Hi there, my name is Freddy Korpshoek for WordPress King and in this video I will show you how you can edit your login page. Maybe you have a membership page or you want to show off to people who try to find out if you're having a WordPress website by checking your domain slash WP admin and I will show you how you can do that. So let's get started. I go to my domain wordpressking.com slash WP dash admin and this is how it looks like right now. A WordPress logo, username, password, a white login form, a little bit darker background, and we are going to change that. So I'm going to log in. I go to plugins and add a new one over here. And I'm searching for Arident custom login. And it's this one from Libin v Babu. Arident custom login and dashboard. Install now. Activate the plugin. And if you want to go to the settings, you can do two things. First one, Arident custom login in your plugins. Go to settings or you go to settings, custom login and dashboard. I close this one for now. Login screen logo. And as you see, we have five tabs. One, two, three, four, five. The first one and the last one we're not going to use. We're only going to use this three. So I start with the login screen background. This is the color right now. I use Firefox to edit the settings and then I use Safari to check the results. So if I change this to black, I scroll down and I save it and I go to Safari and I refresh the page. This is what it looks like. So we better start configuring this page. I go back to my Firefox to login screen background and it is black, but the image is overruling the color. So I have to delete this one for now, save it. And this is what it looks like. So we have to change a lot of things now. I go back to the login screen background options. Uh, we can put an image here. I'm going to do that later. So for now, this is okay. I go to the login screen logo. We need a logo. Right now it's this one. and We want to change it to our own logo. I suggest you use a PNG file with a transparent background. I have one. I click on add logo, upload files, select files. And here it is, WordPress King logo.png. 350 wide, 44 height. I open this one and I insert into the post. If I save it and I check the result, you see the background is transparent, but it's, it's looking weird to me. I have to change some settings. We just saw that the wide of the picture is 350, logo wide, you can put it over here. And the height is 44. So you have to check the height and the wide of your logo. So it will look great. If I hover over the logo, you see powered by your website name. We are going to change that also. I'm just going to say wordpressking.com. And if I save it, I refresh the page. You see it's now 350 wide, the same wide as the login form. And it's in proportions now. So let's edit this stuff over here. I close the login screen logo. I go to the login form settings. And here you can also change it, like if I say 500, then it looks like this. Actually, I like this, so I keep it like this. The login form border radius, it's the radius over here at the corners, I leave it at that. You can change the style. Then it looks like this, I leave it at solid. The thickness, I will keep at four. And the color I change to the color of my logo. And the background color, I make it white. We can use a background image. For now, I delete this one. And we'll come back to this later. The logging form table text color. I keep it black. Here you can change the size. I keep it at 14. Login form input text. I want to have it as the same color of my logo. This one, input text also. 
And I want to change this also to the color of my logo. I never want any shadows. I don't like the look of the shadows over here and here. I want it to be more flat, so I don't want any shadow. No shadow, no shadow. The button login color I also want is the same as my logo. If we take a look now, you see we have changed the background color, added the logo, changed the white of the login form, changed the color of the text, changed the color of this button, we removed all the shadows and now I want to show you how to change the background. I go back to the login screen background and I add a background image. Upload a file, select it, and it's the WordPress King background here. I open it, I insert it into the post, and if I save it, this is the result. It's looking quite okay. You can also change the background of the login form with an image. Right now, the background is white but I can add an image, let's say uh, this one, insert it into the post, save it, refresh the page, and here you have it. Of course, you should change the color of this then, but I don't want to use a background image. So I go back, I remove this, I save it, I log out, I go again to WP admin, and this is how it looks like now. So we went from this to this. Thank you for watching this video, I hope you like it. If you did so, please leave a thumbs up below the video. And if you want more videos like this, then please subscribe. I hope to see you next time. Bye bye.